Hi, I'm Peter Brock, the author of this great book. Well, I think it's a great book anyway. It's Corvette Stingray, Genesis of American Icon. I've told you a lot about what's gone on inside, but I'd like to tell you a little bit about the end in the epilogue. Harley Earl, the guy who really started American automotive design, retired as planned, but Mitchell continued on. He was a great influence on American automotive design and continued to make great cars past the Corvette especially like one of my favorites, the Buick Riviera. What's interesting is that most of us young designers who were involved in that Corvette program with Mitchell were rather frustrated with the slow pace of advancement in a large corporation, and then we left. I was the first to leave. I went back to California to be more involved in racing. I ended up being Carol Shelby's uh, first employee. He never knew that I'd... Uh, done any design work at GM, so he was quite surprised, and I ended up designing America's first FIA world champion, the Ford-powered Daytona Cobra Coupe. I drive one myself. It's still my favorite car, except I run the Corvette engine in it, so that's a, an interesting combination of uh, past and future. The other great guys that worked on the project were Tony Lapine. He went off to work for Opel for a while and designed the the Opel GT, and then was recruited by Porsche and headed up Porsche Design. Even Larry Shinoda, who worked with Tony on the refinement of the uh, Stingray Racer and then finally the production 63 Corvette, uh, left General Motors, went back to Ford, and uh, did some great cars over there like the, uh, like the Mach 1 Mustang. So all of the people that were involved in it were an interesting part of history, and I think you'll really enjoy it. It's all here in the book, so let us know if we can send you a copy. The Corvette Stingray was an incredible adventure in American automotive design. As the last remaining member of the team that created this car, I've written a book called Corvette Stingray, Genesis of an American Icon. In this book, I've got all my original sketches that Bill Mitchell used as the inspiration to create this car, plus about 160 original archival photos from GM Styling that also will help illustrate how the car came to be and who the personalities were that helped create it. That was Bill Mitchell and Zora Duntoff primarily. It's a great, great story. I think you'll really enjoy it. Thank you.